be ready 10 seconds to go start mr vice chairman sir i rise to support the motion of thanks for the president's address i am not in the habit of attacking anybody but in his address to the joint session of parliament the president with great eloquence and lucidity has put all the achievements of government also he has thrown sufficient light on the future policy and programs of this government there is hardly any field which he has not touched upon in the address so it is not necessary for me to elaborate on general issues which have already been included in the president's address because it is a catalog of the achievements of this government it is the duty of the opposition to pinpoint some loopholes no role to play in democracy so we go here and there otherwise they should not be agitated over what they say because a time will come when we have to take vote on this and people will throw them out at the time of voting therefore i do not have any intention to confront what they say and what they point out against the government since it is a general discussion members belonging to different parts of the country use the opportunity to bring out the problems pertaining to their respective areas as you know sir from the north eastern region we are very few and since i represent that region i want to elaborate on certain issues which confront this region because the other major issues in this country like the problems of punjab sri lanka and agitation in up have overshadowed our problems therefore i would like to highlight the specific problems which we are facing in the north eastern region unless this region is developed unless the people of this region feel contented the security of the country in that region is not safe therefore i would like to draw the attention of the house and the members to the need to pay special attention to the very delicate and difficult problems which we face in that region i am happy to say that the recent election results in that region be it nagaland or tripura clearly shows that the people of that region are for emotional integration political integration and that they want 
to participate with the rest of the country in molding the destiny of the nation as an equal partner sir i want to point out some of the missing links which the president may have advertently or inadvertently omitted some of the things which he should have included in the president's address for example the prime minister has declared that he has got an open mind for solution of all the problems of underground nagas within the parameters of the constitution of india i would like to draw the attention of this house to the fact that the insurgency still continues in nagaland manipur even in assam and tripura and you cannot just brush aside this kind of insurgency it has been there since independence before independence we tribals asserted our identity we do not like to be swamped or we do not want to be submerged by the majority community and therefore we asserted our identity our right to survive as a people but it was construed as anti national but it was pandit jawahar lal nehru who recognized this aspiration of the tribal people yes small we are it was he who had given us the political equality with the rest of the country so the tribal people shall never never forget the nehru family today i am saying this because it was only because of pandit nehru that i could be here today as member of parliament now i would like to mention nagaland was a disturbed area for 20 years even now we have the nscn and the federal group of underground people when i was chief minister with the permission of late mrs indira gandhi and the present prime minister i initiated to contact them and i have succeeded to a large extent i told them that whether it is the federal group they are nagas they are indian citizen if we kill each other it amounts to fratricide it is civil war how can you entertain civil war in your own state among your own people among your own brothers so it is always good to bring them together bring them to the talking table so that a solution can be worked out the prime minister during his last visit to nagaland has also said that the door is open for talks within the framework of the constitution of india but at the same time i read 
द पेपर दैट देअर विल बी अ जॉइंट ऑपरेशन ऑफ द बर्मीज आर्मी एंड द इंडियन आर्मी ऑन द वन साइड यू आर सेंग यू जॉइन अस ऑन द अदर साइड अगेन यू वॉन्ट टू यूज डंडाज इज इट पीसफुल एप्रोच आई वुड रिक्वेस्ट द प्राइम मिनिस्टर टू सी वेदर दिस इज अ प्रैगमेटिक एप्रोच स्टॉप